developed and then you want to risk. Is that what you have? Yes, sir. That's right. That's what the recommendation overall for staff is right now. And it was a six to one vote for that, so that's how that's split. <coughs> okay. Well, let me ask you another question. On the use coming up to the driveway, you have utilities and stuff that goes up through that. Huh? They had to be moved. I have power run all the way from the highway to my house in the back. And it goes up that easy. If it has to be moved, I don't have to spend money to have to move it. How is that going to work? Well, I couldn't tell you for sure as far as that, but I'm sure that that's going to be, if those easements has to be moved and those utilities would have to be improved, certainly would think that that would be the responsibility of the developer to get that taken care of. Well, I mean, you, you tell me that, but that doesn't mean it's going to be like that unless it's put in there. Mm -hmm. but that's it's just like, just like the crossing. I mean, it, it's, not, uh, it's not official, but it's... You say we got to do it this way. Mm -hmm. Sure. And well, that could be addressed as a as a condition if, if, if the commissioners choose to do that. If the commissioners choose to do that. Sure. As a recommendation. But again, we would have to recommend that that be one of the conditions, and then of course it moves on to your uh, county commissioners, and then they would have to make the final decision. But we could we could that could be included as a condition. Yes, sir, that's correct. I mean, I, with the existing utilities that are there, I have a hard time believing that the county engineer would use county funds for those improvements or would set up something where you would be responsible, Mr. Stone. I think it would be on the developer. And would that be the same way with the crossing? Yes, sir. Okay. okay. Well, I think that the 